actor Dwayne The Rock Johnson caused quite a stir in Washington, D.C. when he was observed socializing with legislators on Capitol Hill. When the renowned wrestler met with senators on Wednesday to talk about military recruitment, it created a commotion. However, since the actor disclosed last week that he was contacted by political parties in 2022, his visit increased speculation about a potential White House run. However, Johnson stayed silent about any potential campaign and refused to respond when reporters asked if he was thinking about entering the race. He was on the Hill meeting with Senate Majority Whip Dick Durbin and Majority Leader Chuck Schumer, along with XFL business partner Danny Garcia. They talked about his XFL football league and the Fast and Furious star's efforts to assist with military recruitment, according to NBC. Johnson, according to Senator John Tester, who organized the sit-down, is going to advocate for people to join the military over a period of time. He may have the largest following. It's amazing, he continued. It was acknowledged by Senator Susan Collins that she took as many pictures with him as I could. I'm so happy he's assisting with military recruitment, she exclaimed. I believe he is a significant influencer. Among the others who met with Johnson were Senators Lindsey Graham, RSC, Tammy Duckworth, DIL, Todd Young, RN, and Mark Kelly, DAAZ. The movie producer discussed with the delegates not only military recruiting, but also the XFL, which he and Redbird Capital acquired in 2020. The Rock was seen posing for pictures with star-struck admirers in a video shot from within the Capitol. In another video, enthusiastic employees could be seen shooting him as he exited the Capitol on Wednesday afternoon. The 51-year-old stopped to greet Capitol Police and other staff members who had come out to see him as the ruckus outside continued. Johnson disclosed that he had received numerous invitations to run for office last week on Trevor Noah's What Now show. Johnson remarked, At the end of the year in 2022, I received a visit from the parties, inquiring as to whether or not I was going to run. It was significant, and it appeared out of nowhere one after the other, that is. He revealed on Jimmy Fallon's show that the idea has been discussed for a number of years. This talk of running for president has been floating around for the past few years, and it's always so bizarre, he remarked. In addition, he cited a survey that revealed nearly 50% of Americans would support me running for president. It was simply insane. He did, however, remark that he would prefer not to accept a post that would interfere with his time with his three children, who are five, seven, and 22 years old. Following news that the Army, Navy, and Air Force had all failed to meet their recruitment targets by the end of the previous fiscal year, Johnson paid a visit. This was the case even though the Army only recruited 50,000 people, 15,000 fewer than it had hoped.